Hey guys, today I'm coming here with my very first book haul video. I recently went to Goodwill and discovered that they have like a bargain book bin where you can get like a bunch of books for like 16 cents each and I found quite a few books. I mean none of them that I was like, like oh this is a brand new book, I'm really excited. But they were ones that I've been wanting to read for a while or figured why not, it's 16 cents. I can add to my book collection and I can pass them to my kids eventually. So whatever, uh, let's jump right in. Okay, first book I have for you guys is Night School by C.J. Daughtry. Um, I actually won this on a giveaway um, for Epic Reads. I will put their link down below. Go check them out. They have plenty of different giveaways that you can enter and super easy, super fun. Um, so I got this book. I've never heard of it before at all, but it looks super, super interesting. The cover art, if you can tell, is like super cool looking too. Um, there's like a little school and like a moon and it's all creepy and I don't know, I'm really excited to check it out. Um, it's about someone who goes to like a boarding school kind of I guess and a lot of weird stuff happens. Um, I think there's actually a few books out in this series, this came out in 2012. Um, but I'm excited to read it so yeah. Next we have Dan Brown's The Da Vinci Code. I've actually never read the book, never watched the movie, never read any books by him, nothing. So I got this for 16 cents at Goodwill and I was like, okay, I can start here, whatever. Uh, so yeah, hopefully I will read that soon and watch the movie and do a comparison. If that is something you would like to see, let me know. Ooh. Oh yeah, anywho. <laughs> Next we have I can't really tell from the front of it, but it is The Rescue by Nicholas Sparks. I um, got this from my boyfriend's mom. She was having a thrift sale and had put this on the table, and I was like, I'll take it. Don't give it away. I'll read it. Um, I have a lot of books by Nicholas Sparks, but I've never watched this movie, or never read the book. Don't own it. There's not a movie out, so of course I didn't read the watch the movie. Dear gods, I'm going crazy. Anywho, I said check it out. And then, very recently, I went to Goodwill again and picked up five more books, as you can see right there. So, yeah. First book I got was Mitch Albums for One More Day. Uh, don't mind this. I was just peeling off the Target sticker not that long ago, so it looks really crappy, but it won't when I'm done. I just wanted to film this right now. So, I have no idea what this book is about. No idea what any of his books are about. I don't even know if they're fiction or nonfiction or I have no idea. But one of my coworkers is just telling me to check them out. So I saw it for 16 cents and I was like, oh yeah, I'll, I'll read it. Yeah. And if not, I'll give it away to someone else who will read it. So yeah. Next, I got let's do this one. Uh, Let me snick it. The unauthorized bi autobiography. Um, for those who don't know, Lemmy Snicket is a character in the series of Unfortunate Events. Um, I think he's like the narrator of sorts. I've never actually read that series before. Uh, but one would assume this is probably not actually written by him because he's not a person. So one would assume it's probably by Daniel Handler. But um, I've only seen like half of the movie or something. Um, so I'm excited to finally watch the movie, read all of the books, and then read this. Um, it just looked really fun. There's like a lot of pictures and stuff and things like that so I'm excited to uh, actually read it. It just came out last year so have that. And then I got Holes. Most people probably read this in like middle school and I never actually had to. I think I went with my class to watch the movie um, but we had never read the book so I saw it and I was like why not? You know it's obviously very popular um, for that age, obviously it's going to be a really, really quick read, but I said, why not? You know, I love the movie, so I'm sure the book's going to be just as good. Probably better. Um, next, I got Michael Crichton's The Lost World, which is like the second book in the Jurassic Park series. It's like the second movie, I guess. I don't know if there's a third book or fourth. I don't know. Anywho, I got this. I saw it. Um, it looked interesting and there's a picture of dinosaurs in the front oh yeah so I got that super excited and lastly the book that I am the most excited about Time Traveler's Wife by Audrey 
Niffenegger, I would assume is how you pronounce that. I've never read this book before, but I've seen the movie probably like 20 times and I cry every single time I watch it because I love it so much and the feels. The feels, guys, the feels. So I'm excited to finally read the book and see if it is just as good or better than the movie. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited for this. I'm really excited. Yeah. And those are all the books that I got this month. Uh, like I said earlier, or maybe I didn't say it, but I wanted to say it. I don't know. But I'll be having a lot more haul videos for you guys um, because I did get a second job. So I will have a lot more money to buy my books. And it's July and it's my birthday. Woo! Woo! So if uh, anyone still wants to get me a gift, uh, you know, I'll take some books. It doesn't have to be expensive. Goodwill. 16 cents. I'll take it. So, uh, yeah. I will have a lot more books coming out this month because... Um, yeah, I will. So you'll see a lot more of these videos. And uh, let me know if you like them. Because it was fun and now I'm in a really weird mood. So this video probably makes me seem like I'm crazy, but that is fine. Yeah. Bye!